It just keeps happening. News 8 has learned about another crime putting your credit card numbers at risk. Police in Mannheim Township, Lancaster County say this man charged $1,400 to a bank card. The card was still in the owner's possession. Tonight, 8 on your side, consumer reporter Brian Roach continues his investigation with a closer look at who's stealing your information. We've shown you the pictures of suspects. And we've shown you the skimming devices they may be using on bank ATMs in the Susquehanna Valley at an alarming rate. I can tell from reading the reports and uh, speaking with other investigators in the area, it's frequent. Detective Matt Dotz of the Derry Township Police tells me local skimming incidents have increased since late this summer. It's true organized crime that's international. And then there's also an organized crime here locally. This is Hector Montalvo Escalin, also known as Panda. A warrant has been issued for his arrest in Lancaster County. He's suspected of using or cashing out several stolen credit cards in the area. But police sources tell News 8 it's suspected that he's already left the country. They bring people in from overseas. Uh, they put them to work here for a short amount of time, and then they send them back overseas. By the time law enforcement figures this out, the people who actually did the skimming or the cash outs are not even here. It's unknown if Panda actually placed any skimming devices in the Susquehanna Valley, but he could be part of an organized skimmer squad. One person will be doing the skimming, and then other people within that group will be doing the cash outs or the fraudulent transactions. So they're all related. These are the cards the bad guys are trying to get their hands on right now, the old-fashioned magnetic stripe cards. But they could be playing a game of beat the clock. That's because with each passing day, more of these, the chip cards, are coming on the market. They could make skimmers obsolete. So in the weeks and months ahead, it's likely we're going to see a more concerted, organized effort for the crooks to get your card. Now I need as many people as I can trust to help me so that we can maximize these cards that I've got in a short amount of time before the financial industry shuts the cards down. So all this means you cannot let your guard down when it comes to looking for skimmers. We remind you, closely examine all of the card readers, the slots of any bank ATM or a gas pump before you use it. If anything looks out of place, do not use that machine and then report what you see. And as we've reported to you in the past, some banks are now using software to shut down ATMs that have been tampered with. And I'm hearing from a lot of people, namely these two right here, telling me they're paranoid about looking at the card ATM. I'm not going to tell you I'm sorry. I want you looking for it. I was at the gas okay, pump we'll today, wiggling it, because you say <laughs> if it's loose or there's anything hanging Keep down. Keep your money in your pocket. We'll do. <laughs> Thank you, Brian.